Unfortunately, it's been a story that's been rumored in our town for a while. There's a lot of talk tonight in Detroit Lakes about today's arrest of a woman who stands accused of running a corrupt massage parlor in town. 60-year-old Jin Lan Lee is being held on charges including prostitution. Valley News Team's Courtney Lockie has local reaction. It's uh, kind of a relief to have a non-legit business taken down so that we aren't all getting a bad rap. Barbara Steger has owned Barbara's Hair and Body Care in Detroit Lakes for over a decade. This kind of news hits close to home. Massage is such a need and it's so therapeutic that everybody should be getting them and feel safe that they're not going to have wrong things happening. Steger says the news didn't come as a surprise, but that it's still scary to have something like this happen so close. Because it's not okay. News like this spreads quickly, especially in a town the size of Detroit Lakes. This woman says she parks her car in the same lot every morning before work. That's absolutely crazy. Like, it's unbelievable. Holmes says she noticed what she thought was suspicious activity in the area, but never could have dreamt of something so awful. I'm so glad because it's those girls are taken advantage of, I feel, and it's nobody should be in that position. Authorities say so far, Lee's been the only one that's been taken into custody from the massage parlor, but two other search warrants were conducted at locations that are related to the business, and the investigation isn't over yet. Live in Detroit Lakes, Courtney Lockie, Valley News Live. Thanks so much, Courtney. Local law enforcement, along with several other agencies, including the Minnesota BCA and the West Central Drug Task Force, are investigating. The law